Hello everyone, and welcome to our guide on how to join a Minecraft server. Great news, you just launched your Minecraft game and are so excited to launch your new Nitrato server. But how do you get onto the server? You might think it's obvious, or if you're familiar with how to get onto games in the past, maybe you think it is, but it's not always that straightforward, so today we're going over how to join. How to join through Java. If you're playing the Java version of the game, which can be from anything from Bucket to Vanilla, then you need to know how to get your IP from your server. Up in the top left, go ahead and copy the IP address and make sure that when you launch the game, you're playing the right version of the game that will work for the version of Java. For me, Optifine 1.19.3 will work just fine for the Bucket version of 1.19.3. So once you've launched the game, go to multiplayer, and in the bottom right, go to add server. And here is where you will add your server name, which is the server name for Nitrato, so in my case, I'm just putting Nitrato server, and then I'm putting the IP address under the server address section, with the port at the end. Once you've got it good, hit done, and then after just a few seconds, you'll see that it says, welcome to server. Well, mine will at least, because I changed the welcome message to say something a little nicer to make me feel better. Jokes aside, if you've done everything right so far, hitting play will take you into the server. How to join through Bedrock. Bedrock is pretty similar overall, but what you need to make sure you're doing is running the right version of the game on your server. Java won't work in this case, so go ahead and stop your server, and once the server is stopped, scroll down to the bottom left hand side where you see the switch game option. Go ahead and click on that in order to get to the next page, and here at the next page, you're going to look up the Bedrock version of the game. If you have less than five games installed, then you're good to go and install this straight away. So hit that green install button and double down on the pop-up that says install. After just a few seconds, it will launch up the Bedrock version on your server instead of the previous version, in my case, the Bucket version. What you want to do from here now is, once again, take the IP address and go into your Minecraft launcher and make sure that you're playing Minecraft for Windows. Windows and Bedrock are synonymous in this case, so go ahead and hit play. In the main menu, once again you want to hit play right at the top, and then you're going to see three tabs at the top, Worlds, Friends, and Servers. Click your Servers tab, and then all the way below Featured Servers, go down to Additional Servers where you can click Add Server. Server is starting to not sound like a word anymore. Under Server Name, I am putting Nitrato Server because I am nothing if not simple, and then under Server Address, go ahead and add in your IP again. And under the port, add the last five numbers under your server address and then delete them in the server address. Then you can just click the save button on the right or click play right away so that you can join the server right away. Either way, this will add your server to the additional servers list. And every time you go back into this section of this game, then you can just hit your join server button underneath the server name. Common issues. The real issue that you're going to run into, the main one at least, is just being unable to connect for whatever reason. There are a ton of reasons that this could happen, and unfortunately it's not always the easiest to narrow down exactly what the problem is. So I'm just going to give you a blanket couple of ideas for you to try. First is make sure that your server is on, which may seem obvious, but sometimes that's the case. Second is check your internet. Sometimes you may even need to reset it, and that will fix the problem. The next thing is to restart your device, whether that's your PC or laptop or whatever you're playing on. Next is disable VPNs, check for firewall programs, or conflicting programs that might be blocking your connection. Finally, you can try connecting to your server on a different network if you have that available option. These aren't foolproof strategies, but they hopefully will work. Conclusion. Well, that's how you connect to your Minecraft, Java, or Bedrock servers. Hopefully you found this tutorial helpful. Sometimes it may feel like these are the obvious things, but not to everybody. If you happen to like this video, please consider leaving a like, subscribing, and ring that notification bell, so that way we know this is the type of content you like to see. Until next time.